Right, welcome to another BrickStackers.com Lego set review. Today, I'll be reviewing the City Set 60018, the Cement Mixer. Uh, and this one, the 2013 model, uh, has two minifigures and 221 pieces. Uh, of course, it's, it's set for ages 5 to 12. Um, as you can see from the back, You've got uh, a couple of accessories that will come with it, which we'll look at once we open the box up. Uh, again, this is model 60018, part of the city uh, construction kind of a theme they've got going on with some of their big trucks. Uh, and so what I'm going to do now is uh, open the box for you. We will uh, go hand me my pocket knife over there on the... Uh, you get that one right there, that little knife. We're going to cut this box open and... Uh, Let's see here. We'll cut her open, see what you got on the inside, uh, and then we will stop the video and build it and come back and review all the parts. Set it over there, please. All right, so let's see what we've got in here. Instruction booklet pretty thick. Uh, looks to be about 15 uh, steps to this one. So you get your instruction booklet. And we have several numbered bags. Two numbered bags. And of course the mixer and a sheet of decals so we will uh, now open up separate the parts and then build this and we'll be right back with the review all right we're back uh we have it assembled took a little bit of time to assemble it because i had uh, i think it was eight stickers or eight decals to put on and i have to take my time doing those to get them just right I think I did pretty good on it. But first I wanted to show you was the minifigs that came with it. We got two in the series in the set. Uh, and you got a little wheelbarrow as in a, an accessory and a shovel. And you do have stones or a little Legos versions of stones that will go in the wheelbarrow. And so I'm gonna move the wheelbarrow out. It does roll, it's got a tire on it that does roll with no problem. Move that out and back here a little bit. Now, for the minifigs, as you can see, we have two. Uh, <clears throat> This guy would be the one the set has as the one using the wheelbarrow and shovel behind the back of the uh, uh, cement mixer, the cement truck. As you can see, he's got a goatee. He's wearing his safety glasses, uh, orange construction jacket uh, with a pin and zips up, khaki bottoms, no side or back printing. Uh, as you can see, and he's got a red hard hat on. So he is ready for working out in the field. All right, so as you can see, uh, the second one is what we, Lego has as the driver of this set. Uh, he uh, is wearing some very bright orange construction uh, pants. And when I say bright, this is probably the brightest I've seen on, at least on my set of minifigs. He's got an orange pair of overalls on, uh, going over a blue shirt. And uh, he's got a black, uh, more of a baseball type hat than it is a hard hat and and he also has no back printing or any side printing his face is a uh, brown eyebrows uh, and he's smiling as you can see so that's the two minifigs set these guys over to the side and let's show you now the actual uh, truck now for the cement truck, the cement mixer, it's very detailed. Uh, I do have, uh, like I said, uh, a lot of stickers that we had to put on, not a lot, it was eight decals. I don't like decals at all, and most Lego fans don't, but it did have eight. And I decided to go ahead and put them on there to make it look pretty good, because it, it, without it, it had been a pretty uh, bland looking um, mixer. But anyway, uh, it does have a lot of moving parts. Uh, I will say on this review that if you are uh, 
getting this for a smaller child or you are a smaller child watching this video uh, it can be kind of frustrating uh, to play with and keep everything together this it, it can be played with don't get me wrong it's just got a lot of movable parts that can easily come off uh, and I'm going to show you these of course you've got the uh, eight wheels on the on the truck all of them roll great no problem no friction uh, the doors do open up uh, as you can see like most automobiles that uh, Lego makes the mirrors can go up and down and adjust on both sides as you can see uh, as I move it around you can see that these things do fold in and out uh, while I've got it on this side let's go ahead and turn it and show you the front the front windshield as you can see uh, our driver's got a coffee mug sitting on the dashboard you've got a steering wheel on the inside um, you, you know one of your decals is your uh, license plate on this side you got your stack uh, again doors and mirrors open uh, you've got a decal down here it says uh, caution electrics uh, and this is like your electrical box to for trucks to power the uh, cement mixer on the back is your cement mixer this goes up and down to control it's supposed to control the flow of your cement coming out the back uh, so this does move up and down as you can see and there is another decal that we had to put on. Uh, the chute, I guess you would call it, goes up and down and moves left or right. So you can control where you move your cement and it comes off just like that. So if we don't put it on hard enough, it will pop off. But anyway, that's what I was talking about. It does move. It's just you got to be real careful moving it. Um, so we put this back down. We can also pop the cab up just like most uh, of your 18 wheeler semi trucks to work on the engine uh, the cab does come up and come back down if we rotate it back around and I'll tell you one thing that I was surprised about this little decal you put on here it tells you you move this this is what cranks your uh, cylinder to pour the concrete out now this has got three gears in it that you put in Lego gears and it's got a drive shaft drive shaft that goes down through it that turns this so if you watch I can uh, actually let the rocks that Lego gives you pour out of the back. I'm going to try to do this where you can see what's happening. I can turn this wheel like this. And as you watch the back end, let me adjust that. Had it up too high. You'll see the rocks popping out, or the cement. This is supposed to be your cement popping out. And then, of course, on the box, you know. They put the actual wheelbarrow up under here and you could fill up your wheelbarrow. Um, and like I said, I had my chute up too high and I think that's all. Now, as you can see right here, this uh, barrel does move it. So if you move your cab up like this, you can also raise the cement mixture up like this. If you needed to reload it or something like that, it does move up. So as you can see, we have a lot of movable parts. It's a cool little set. Uh, relatively inexpensive for two minifigs and as much movement as you do get but again for a smaller child uh, you would have parents or older brothers or sisters would have to constantly keep putting parts on so I would uh, definitely stick to the age requirements uh, for this one it's a good display set uh, for construction or if you like trucks or just the basic city model that you're building but again it does have a lot of moving parts all right we thank you for watching this review uh, if you do have uh, any questions or would like to look us up on the web, check us out at BrickStackers.com and you can follow us on Twitter at BrickStackers. Um, again, we'd love to hear your comments uh, below uh, and we ask that you do like and share our videos. Until next time, we'll see you later.